Right, so in the last video, I applied a body filler to the helmet and in this video, I'll be sanding down the helmet with sandpaper and files and other tools just to get rid of all the imperfections find out where the low spots are and basically making this helmet look smooth so what I got here is uh, a few tools I have a rough file a half round file which means this this area is round and this area is flat and a flat um, smooth file and over here I got a sanding block usually for sanding blocks people will use a, a block of wood but as long as it's a flat rigid piece it's fine so I'm using a plastic acrylic and in this box here I have some sandpaper and this is um, 150 grit this is uh, 220 and this is 320 and 500 so for 150 would be for uh, sanding down and shaping it and 220 would be smoothening out and getting the, the shape profile and the 400 and onwards is for making the surface smooth so I'll start out with uh, 150 grit sandpaper but first I'm gonna get the profile off like this area so I'm gonna use a rough file to sand the, the edge just to get all these um, imperfections off first and then I'll hit it with a sandpaper so let me just Place the camera here. Okay. Now I'll start with this part of the face plate. Oops. Yeah, so just get get on with the file and just sand. So for the file, we don't want to send it too much or it'll eat into the material. So you just want it to be something like this. And then you just do the same for the rest of the helmet. So I'll go ahead and do that and then I'll get back to you. I have done uh, some uh, rough filing for the helmet. Get out, get the, most of the, some of the details out. So now I'm going to use the sanding block that I have and wrap it around the sandpaper and then start sanding it because uh, when sanding you need to use a sanding block if you just use go on the sandpaper like that with your fingers what happens is the, your fingers will cause a uh, waviness around the the surface that you're sanding on so if you just sand it like this what happens is this part will become a little bit wavy it won't become um, flat or or brown so it's best to use a sanding block so just put it right above your sand sandpaper wrap it around like this and then just start sanding it so I'm gonna go ahead and sand the helmet with a 150 grit sandpaper and then once I've gone through um, most of the helmet I will go up and then um, start with a 220 grit sandpaper and then 320 grit so that way the um, the whole helmet will become more smooth so I'll go ahead and do that and then I'll show you how it looks like right so I've sanded the whole helmet with a 150 grit sandpaper as you can see um, if you sand till you can see the cardboard it means you should stop sanding this area and then head over to another area because if you hit in this area too much you'll eat in the material of the cardboard and that's not what you want so now um, I'm gonna use um, 220 grit sandpaper and sand the whole helmet so it becomes more smooth because you can see there are still imperfections on the helmet so we're gonna go ahead and uh, try to get rid as much uh, imperfections as possible okay after sanding with the 220 grit sandpaper um, most of it looks pretty smooth already but there are many low spots that need to be filled in, like over here. 
areas like over here they are rather low so I need to fill it in with more body filler um, many areas are like over here 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 needs more sanding and the front as well over here this area as well so there are a lot of areas to be filled in but now we have to just get the whole basic profile done so um, I'll go ahead and uh, sand with uh, 320 grit and finally 500 grit and then once it's done it should be smooth enough and then I'll go ahead and primer it once to have a better look at all the imperfections so they'll be easier to see okay done with the 320 grit and most of it seems pretty smooth already but it's not smooth enough yet imperfections can't be helped you have to fill in with more body filler now is to just get the basic profile done so sand it one more time 500 grit sandpaper and yes sanding can get really really messy so remember to wear an apron because i didn't wear an apron so my pants is very clean okay last big last sanding 500 grit and then once it's done um i'll get back and then i'll primer it with once so you can see the imperfections better and then um, hide all the uh, exposed cardboard and so the helmet has been fully sanded it's quite smooth already so now I'm gonna paint it with some primer and then uh, let it dry and then find where all the imperfections are and then fill them in with body fill Yeah, it looks so much clearer now after I sprayed the primer. There's still some areas that I haven't sprayed on yet. Looks like the can is gonna be empty soon. Yeah, so here's the helmet after I've primed the whole helmet. So it looks a lot smoother now, but there are still imperfections on the face plate on this side the back the top basically there are still imperfections everywhere so um, in the next part I will do some um, filling to fill up the low spots here and basically rectify all the imperfections